Yo, what's going on guys? It is Kevin here and today I'll be going over Pokemon X and Y online in 2022. You know, can you still be a Pokemon? Can you do good trades? Is it just completely dead? Do people still play the game? That's the biggest question. But before I get into this video, I just want to say I got the video idea from someone named Papacy, who I believe it was 2021. He had a video like this, Pokemon X and Y online. So I'm just going to say right here, I did not fully think of this idea myself. I did remember he made a video and a whole year has gone by. New Pokemon games came out, so I just wanted to test it for myself. Thank you all for watching and subscribing. Whatever you do, just be in here. It means a lot. So thank you all and let's get right into it. Okay, so right here, I got Pokemon X on my, I believe it's a 2DS XL. Let's just boot up into it, though. It will take a second. All right, there's the old Pokemon X screen. Haven't seen this in a long time. But yeah, we're just going to boot it up. I think, yeah, here's my Cavdog file. Uh, badges 6. I guess I didn't complete this. It's been a while, but we're going to check online. I think the first thing we're going to do is a Wonder Trade. We're going to do, like, one Wonder Trade and see if we get a good Pokemon. So yeah, we gotta connect to the internet. Uh, 2002, my date was definitely wrong on here when I last played. Wonder Trades were never really recognized as a way to get good Pokemon, unless if you did a ton of them and got really lucky. But we're gonna do one trade first, and let's just see if we even get something remotely good. Let's just give him this level one Oddish. I don't know where I got this from, but let's see. Who will I pair up with? It's probably not gonna be someone in the US, but I actually wanna see how long will it even take? because it's 2022. Are people still playing X and Y? Maybe I could even pair up with someone from Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. I think that was the thing. We got Noah from Ontario, Canada. Well, that's actually not what I expected. I expected maybe Brazil or just a, a different type of country, but let's just see. I'm not giving anything good. I'm just giving a random oddish, so I'm not expecting anything too amazing myself. A Torkoal, hey, that's not bad. Well, we're getting a Torkoal from One Wonder Trade. It's not something from Route 1, that's for sure. At far away place i'm not sure where that is this might have been caught in omega ruby and alpha sapphire odds are probably was if it says far away place now we will head into the gts uh there we go so in the gts this is where you offer or deposit pokemon pretty much just like hey i got this and i would like to get this anyone want to go for it so we're gonna seek i guess it has to be some pokemon that i've seen because i only have six badges haven't done haven't done that much uh abra why not what do these people want though any Raikou, Tepig, Clauncher, Dewblade, Volcanion, that's not happening. Just, just an Abra swap, casual. Chansey level 91 or higher. Shiny, please. That's not happening. Moltres. You know, there's actually there's a pretty good amount of options in here. I could scroll for quite a while. This one's a Shiny. Wait. For any Ekans, really? I mean, I don't have an Ekans, but really? That must not be a legitimate one, because Shiny Abra, that's just a straight-up giveaway. Oh, wait, what the? There's multiple. Huh? There's so many, and they're all named Volcanion. Oh, yeah. You can see down here, they said J. Dunn Free. I don't know what that means. I'm not sure what J. Dunn means, but I can see the word free right down here, so... Maybe they're just giving out free Pokemon? I'm not quite sure. It's all the same guy as well. Huh. Let me search a different Pokemon. I don't know why they're all called Volcanion. Let me check a Pokemon that's a bit harder to get. Yeah, we'll go with Garchomp. That's not going to be something that's seen that often. Garchomp, definitely not as popular as Abra when it comes to availability. Any Deancey, that's pretty rare. Landorus, Zigzagoon. Huh? Gender and level is quit the GTS. We got a Discord link down here. What's quit the GTS? How do you even put that there? Any back? What? What am I... What is this? Is the GTS hacked or something? These Garchomps don't have nicknames, and this is all the same person. Except for those first ones. Okay, so this is someone's Discord tag. Someone's Snapchat? What the heck? Sub me on, and then a Snapchat and Instagram. What is the GTS? You know, I don't know what I was expecting, but it definitely wasn't this. This is a ton of advertising and seemingly a bunch of glitched Pokemon. I don't know what gender any back means. And quit the GTS? Since when could you type custom things right here? Garchomp was too weird of a search. I don't know what that was all about. So we're going to search maybe uh, Kyogre. Why not? That's going to be it. That's a literal legendary Pokemon. We can't see too many options in here, right? There's a shiny just for any Groudon. Wow. Uh, oh, no. Oh, okay, I see what's going on. Actually, how is this even possible? These are all the same person. 
and you can only deposit one Pokemon on the GTS at a time. I'm guessing they went on their game and submitted a Kyogre to the GTS, and then after that, they probably had a hacked 3DS to where they were able to get their save file back and like restore it, and then submit the Pokemon again on a pretty much another save file. I think that's what's happening here. Oh yeah, there's a Discord link as well. Dang, it looks like if you want to do any real trading, it's not happening. Because, what is this? And they want any Snivy. I'll search Raikou right now. This is a shiny. I don't know if you can even get Celebi level 11 to 20 though. Raikou again, that's still shiny. Wait, for any Zigzagoon? What? What the heck is that text? What's this? These are some weird... Add me on... Oh, not this guy again. Snap and Instagram. Oh, gosh. Here's a ton of Discord links. You know, I guess I should have known. And YouTube links as well. Huh. Well, that, I guess this is this is what I've seen so far from X and Y Online in 2022. The GTS is just wrecked. This is just horrible. What happened to it? Let's do another Wonder Trade. I wonder if there's any of these Pokemon with the website names or Instagrams being sent off in Wonder Trade for free. Or if you have to use the GTS and trade them. I'm putting my Torkoal in the Wonder Trade, the one that I just got, the one named Howitt, and we're going to see what happens. Will I get another normal trade like this, or someone advertising an Instagram? We'll find out pretty soon. Alright, we got Kyle from Queensland, Australia. That's a pretty normal sounding place. Doesn't sound like he's about to send me his Instagram name. It's only one way to find out though, and we're going to know really soon. Goodbye, Howitt. I've only known you for a couple minutes, but, you know, please give me something better. Okay, Silcoon. Or Cascoon, I don't know. I get them mixed up all the time. This seems like the average wonder trade. You know, just a Pokemon from level 1 to 10. Either hatched from an egg or caught on one of the first routes in the game. That's pretty much what I remember it being back then. We're going to check on it just in case. If it's a level 100 shiny amazing Pokemon. And yeah, it's level 6. When was it obtained though? Uh, It was his. It was that Kyle guys. I mean this Pokemon is 2 days old so it's still relatively new. It's caught by the Kyle guy that I just traded with, so I guess that's pretty cool. Definitely not the most valuable Pokemon in the world. Definitely worse than that Torkoal as well. We're going to do one more Wonder Trade. The GTS, that was a busted area. So I'm going to click on Trade. This is going to be the last thing I do. Uh, trade with someone far away. Oh, yeah, so I have to just click on individual people and hope they say yes. So I'm going to click on this guy with, I believe, a Japanese name. My trade got accepted, like, Really quick, right away. This guy's not going to be happy with my uh, my Silcoon right here. I'm not even going to show him that. What is this Celebi from? I don't know where I got this. It's level 10. I'll click show. You want this guy? Um, what about this Mewtwo? What's this from? Doesn't even have a nickname. Entei. That was a shiny Entei right there. I don't know what else I would really give him. Maybe this Sceptile. Hey, man. You want this? I have a feeling this guy has pretty much every Pokemon in the game. His boxes don't look too full, but he's showing some pretty good stuff. You want this Mewtwo? Please? I really don't think he does. Oh, you want to swap? I'll take that Greninja, because it's just something different. Oh, wait. It's like the exact same. We both have no nickname in a Cherish Ball trade. I guess we might be swapping right now? Nope, he clicked decline. Okay. Uh, Lapras, it's the best Pokemon in the game. You're going to have to want it. Come on. Let me click off it right here. Please say yes. Mm, I don't see that happening. Unless if he just really likes Lapras. Nope. Okay, maybe he wants my Mewtwo for it. Just maybe. We gotta get one successful trade. Okay, showing Greninja again. Trade. He clicked no before. Okay, he's just instantly clicking no. I'm gonna leave the trade. Doesn't look like this guy has anything that he's gonna give for any of my Pokemon. Still haven't got out of this trade yet because I think this guy's offering a Pokemon. And I'm clicking that I want to leave the trade. So I can't really get out. But that's pretty much it for this video. It looks like the GTS is just totally ruined. It's totally full of Pokemon that seemingly are glitched out. They have no nicknames or they're advertising a Instagram or Snapchat or Discord or something like that. So I don't know what that's all about. Wonder Trade seems to be fine though. There are still definitely a lot of people playing. When I look at my acquaintances, I see I could scroll for quite a while. Same with Passerby. I could, whoa, you guys see that? I could scroll for a really long time in the Passerby. So yeah, there are definitely still people playing online in 2022. You could probably find someone to battle, 
but they might have Pokemon that are, you know, blatantly cheated into the game, so not sure how you want to go with that, but I think that's going to be it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.